big or small, we've got it all. Everyone will find something at the Crazy Store. It's no wonder South Africa considers the Crazy Store the crazy fun place to shop. Well, the truth is there's nothing quite like the smell of a nice, delicious bride coming through, especially around this time of the year when it's our wonderful South African delicacies that are obviously toasting away on those brides. So Heritage Day is upon us and we just can't wait to light up our fires and serve up some great drinks with our loved ones you know, to celebrate this delicious tradition. Now, to ensure that your day goes off without a hitch or a glitch, we've put together some extremely cool, entertaining tips thanks to the Crazy Store and their wide variety of homeware items. Now, let's get it started with a nachi mocktail recipe that goes beyond the bra. Yeah, firstly, check out the setup mm. that you can have once you've made all of this delicious. It's an array. Yeah, I mean, the variety that you spoke about right now, mm. very, very much there. Mm. So if you want to be making this mocktail, you'll need certain few ingredients, some yeah. ice, some uh, sparkling water, Water, yeah. uh, some nachis, Clement Gold nachis. They're in season right now, so you can mm. find them almost at any store. And then some uh, limes that you squeeze. Sweet. In case you're wondering how to get nachi juice, that's how you cut it. Because okay. I was asking Nicole whether you had to like peel it and then take <laughs> one by one. By six. <laughs> <laughs> that could that, take that a long might time. take the whole day. <laughs> then you won't have the bride. Cut it in half, and then of course just squeeze. And okay. You know. But I'm gonna leave this to look pretty over here. Sweet. So and what do you do? You've oh, got one of these wonderful this. mixes that we used, I think, last week to make a batter yes. for baking. So yep. what you're going to do is, let's say, let's squeeze a, one lime in there. Obviously, that's going to enhance the flavor. Mm -hmm. Of course, it's, it is very potent. Don't Yeah, so you don't want estimate. too much yeah. of it in there. So, so obviously, we're making we'll use of this two-liter mixing and measuring jug, which is used to make the mocktail. Mm -hmm. um, it's very practical. It's a two-liter mixing and measuring jug. It's not only useful for baking, mm -hmm. uh, it's got dual use. It's perfect for the mix-up of, uh, you know, batch celebratory drinks, yep. cocktails and mocktails over the long weekend. And it really ensures that you always measure your ingredients accurately and, uh, and properly. Absolutely. Okay, so we've got some syrup that we've made here. With uh, It's infused with star anise. Mm. So we're all about flavor infusion over here. So I'll take about this much, depending on how much sugar you want or how sweet you want, you want your it. drink to be. Nice. Then, of course, you add your ice, a couple of them just cubes. to make sure it's nice and chilled so mm. that you can serve it nice and cool to your guests. There we go. Mm. Give this over here. And then the magic, just pop it on top. Very easy. Close it up yeah. and then you mix it. Just, just turn, 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 turn to mix. Just to make sure everything is nicely mixed in. Uh -huh. And then we are ready to serve. Fantastic. Please. So we've got these cylindrical uh, jars here that we're using to serve up our mocktails. Yep. These are really cool because they allow you to really get creative in terms of how you're serving it up. Uh, not only are they great to display beautiful flower arrangements because you can do that, uh, little flower arrangements, but you can also, also use them to drink. Yeah, be creative. Be Pretty absolutely creative. Yeah. So we're going to... Just get them. Obviously, and they come. Mm -hmm. No, go ahead, go ahead. They come with these reusable straws, which is fantastic because everyone's really paying attention to saving the planet. Excellent. Everyone's doing that right now. Good no idea. one wants paper straws. These are really cool because uh, they're reusable. Yeah. And then, mm -hmm. just to kind of spice things up a little bit, we've got some rosemary yeah. that we are going to throw in break there. off over here and then throw it into oh, the, the mocktail. It's to to look Easy. nice also for those Insta pictures. There we go. But the keyword is crazy. SMS crazy to double three seven two eight. We'll send you a uh, a text with a link to the recipe how to make this mocktail and get going with the, the family this long weekend. There we it go. Looks look really at that. Cool. Let that. Awesome. I mean, obviously you'll prepare this before the guests arrive. So oh, yeah. let the rosemary infuse there for a couple of minutes, yeah. and then there you go. Shall we have a have it's a taste? It's simple. It's quick and easy to make. Let's see. Mm. Oh, that's good. Just holding this guy handle makes you feel like a long weekend day. Cheers! Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Two double three seven two eight. We'll SMS you the recipe. Cheers! <laughs> Big or small, we've got it all. Everyone will find something at the Crazy Store. It's no wonder South Africa considers the Crazy Store the crazy fun place to shop.